When it comes to neuroplasticity, we're used to thinking about positive brain change, but that's not always the case. Sometimes our brain changes in negative ways as well. Dr. Norman Deutsch talks about this so-called dark side of neuroplasticity and explains why that is. Plasticity gives rise to a lot of things we don't like about ourselves. Our bad habits are a function of the fact that our brains are plastic. So while the main message of the brain that changes itself is that the human brain is far more resilient, far, far more resilient than most people ever imagined, especially in its response to injury and illness. Um, it's also far more vulnerable than we imagined insofar as the brain can be changed by experiences for better or for worse. And when we develop bad habits and we use our brain over and over in a bad way, um, it's not just that we are thinking the wrong thoughts, but we're actually changing the structure of our brains and altering the brain's reward system to some degree so that we now have this new circuitry, which kind of takes on a, a demon-like zone, if you will. Once we understand that there are two sides to neuroplasticity, we can then begin to take the right steps and practice the habits that'll protect and rewire our brain for longevity and optimum health. To hear about other ways we can influence brain change, from learning disabilities to chronic pain, please join us for the webinar with Norman Deutsch this week. It's free to watch at the time of broadcast. Just click the link below to sign up.